Guys, today I am revealing another RC in my RC arsenal. The 17 scale Arma Fire Team BLX 6S Assault Vehicle. I'm gonna say first off, you guys, I love this car. I probably say that about a lot of cars, but um, this is kind of a military based offering, I guess. And some of you guys may know I'm a military guy myself. So when I saw this car, I just I just love it. I was like, man, I need to get one of these things. And you know, it's a 6S four wheel drive, decent size, one seven scale RC car, man. I mean, what, what would you not love about it, right? So <clears throat> I'm gonna kind of show you guys the car real quick. Uh, go over the specs. Of course, you can go on the website, on Arma's website or other YouTube videos and people will tell you what the specs are. I'm gonna kind of go over them myself. Uh, I think I have one or two upgrades on this thing as well. So, and then I'll kind of, and then I'll let you know how I acquired it. Cause I did buy this vehicle used you guys on Facebook Marketplace. And I got a pretty decent deal on it. Because you know, I won't buy it if I don't get a decent deal, right? That's how we all are. You know, you gotta get a deal so you just might as well buy it new. First off, we'll, we'll uh, look at the at the body. Uh, the guy I bought it from was an older gentleman, and I don't think he even rolled this thing on its top. It's that nice. Um, I like the the full roll cage on it with the with the military guys inside. Pretty detailed for what it is. Underside is in really really nice condition of course so uh, actually I'm not gonna be running this body you guys I decide I'm gonna get a Savage XL body uh, I find that those fit on these cars really well so I'll pick up a Savage XL body use that body as a run body and then use this one as my display body so that's that's the dealio on that so we'll go over the specs here. Uh, first, I'm gonna show you guys, uh, I do got some uh, HR hub carriers in the front or knuckles or whatever you wanna call them. You might be able to see them in there. So we've got some HRs uh, hubs in the front. It does have a center aluminum brace, uh, which is good. Uh, we got a 150 amp ESC. Uh, 2050 kV motor uh, all on one side of the vehicle um, this you guys this car has a mechanical handbrake on it which is pretty cool with the servo uh, servo runs the brake here which is is pretty neat actually I, I think it's a, a neat feature on this car and this car does uh, can, can exceed 60 plus mile an hour with the right gearing and running on 6S, of course. Um, other than that, you guys, uh, the tires, I do love the tires. I like the way they look. They're, they're kind of stiff on the sidewalls. Actually, they are stiff. And then the, 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 and then the tread is really soft. So I do like the wheels and tires, especially for the terrain that you put this vehicle through. Arma says this is a extra long wheelbase, right? So, and it kind of looks long because, and the reason being is it's, it's a skinnier chassis here. And it kind of makes it look long. But don't get me wrong, it is long. Because this is a pretty decent sized vehicle and it's pretty, pretty wide as well. Um, as you can see, the underside here, it does have a few little, it does have some scratches on the chassis, uh, aluminum. Uh, the A arm's in really good condition, so the guy took care of it. I think he may have ran it a couple times. Uh, fairly clean car for sure. I wouldn't have bought it, of course. Uh, it does come with your 2.4 gigahertz remote. You need double A's. You'll need a charger, of course, when you buy this new. But that's it, you guys. Um, just love this car. And I'll tell you guys how I acquired the car little story here and actually the body goes on pretty good 
There's these uh, four. There's these four holes here on the body. You just go right through these four little pins here, and if, once you get that lined up really good, the body should drop right in there, just like that. Dropped right in there. Voila. So there it is, you guys. That's that's a sick ass vehicle. It does have aluminum threaded body shocks as well. Um, and the suspension is really nice on this. Uh, really surprised with the suspension. It, it's gonna need suspension, really good suspension on the train that it runs on. So another thing I wanna mention, you guys, it does have IC5 connectors on it, which I actually do personally like. Um, and the steering's not bad on this thing. Um, it's got a 265 ounce uh, torque servo in it, which is not real bad. But uh, other than that, you guys, I love the car. Um, I'm gonna be keeping this thing in my collection. Now I wanna let you guys know how I acquired this car. I uh, acquired it on Facebook Marketplace. And, you know, like I said before, if I don't get a good deal on the used ones, I just go buy new. So my collections probably consist of me buying new, brand new RCs, and then maybe the other half I bought used. So something, something like that so far. <clears throat> um, so I seen it on Marketplace, seen how nice it was. Uh, I, apparently the guy had multiple vehicles for sale. And I was like, oh man, I can't resist. I gotta go check it out, right? You know how it is. So I went looking, looking at all his cars. Uh, I seen this one, had to have it, because of course it's a military assault vehicle. Had to have this thing and it's 6S and four wheel drive and all that stuff. And if some of you guys already know me by now, I love the bigger RC cars. So I go for the big ones. But uh, but yeah, we ended up hashing a deal out on this car and I actually bought some other ones from him as well. So it kind of worked out. And he's about, I don't know, 35, 40 minutes from me. So that worked out really well. Uh, came home with some RCs that day and uh, like I showed you guys earlier in the video, this thing is in really, really nice shape. Um, I don't buy them unless they're in really nice shape. So that's it, you guys. On my 1.7 scale uh, Arma Fire Team 6S brushless four wheel drive assault vehicle. Another vehicle I wanted to reveal to you guys. Um, that's what this channel's about. I like, I love to, to reveal cars that I buy and um, new or used doesn't matter and of course i'll start running these cars doing reviews and whatnot repair videos so on and so forth so that's it you guys i appreciate you watching like comment share subscribe hit the bell and uh go out and buy you one of these and we'll see you on the next one